I'm Kelly Miles and I have Crohn's disease. I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease when I was 10 years old. Crohn's disease is an inflammatory bowel disease. Um, it's chronic. For me, um, I mostly had a lot of flare-ups when I was younger. Um, and as an adult, they've been more few and far between um, until about two years ago where I had a flare-up that required me to have surgery here at Omni Med. Two years ago, I had started to show some signs of a flare-up. I had, you know, pulled an all-nighter doing schoolwork, um, decided to go to the bathroom before going to bed, and I had noticed that I had started having bleeding again. And um, I had gone into the bedroom to tell my boyfriend, like, you know, I'm having bleeding, I think I need to go to the emergency. And in the process of doing that and sitting on the bed, I just passed out right on the floor. And in that instance, you know, we called the ambulance, I got brought into the ER, and I ended up staying in the hospital for a week, I had to get blood transfusions and all of that. Um, two weeks went by, I went back to work, um, and I just noticed that I was just really tired, out of breath going up the stairs, um, just, you know, off. I made it home, I had my mom meet me there. Um, and I looked in the mirror, I saw that I was like pale and I just knew that, you know, I had to get to the, the ED. So um, we called the ambulance then, came in, um, I ended up needing blood transfusions again. That's when they brought Dr. Lee into my case um, and ultimately they had to decide to, you know, operate. Kelly underwent an ileocolic resection where her disease, recurrent disease was and that the ileocolic resection means, means removing that part of the small bowel where uh, it meets the colon, so ileocolic resection, and uh, that was done laparoscopically, so minimal invasively, instead of making big incisions, um, where the recovery could be long and pain, painful, we can make, uh, we can do the surgery with three, four small incisions. I have lived elsewhere as an adult, just for like work and things like that in the past, and um, have had minor flare-ups where I've had to, you know, go to other hospitals, and it seems like I always compare it to Albany Med, like Albany Med has become my gold standard for like patient care. And I just would like to say thank you to Dr. Betzold, to Dr. Ju, to nurse practitioner Sue Sampson for all the hard work that they've put into my case over the years, um, their professionalism, their patient-centered care, and their diligence when it's come to, you know, trying to make sure that I receive the best care and that we had answers in my particular case. Since the surgery, I've been able to get back into working out, I can travel. I've been working at Albany Med for the past six years, four years here as a nurse in the NICU. What I like the, the best about being an Albany Med nurse is just um, the quality of care we provide and also just um, knowing that in doing what you know I've been trained to do, you know, I can make a difference.